Quantum tunneling is one of the most fascinating phenomena in quantum mechanics, allowing particles to pass through barriers that would be impossible to penetrate according to classical physics. In our everyday world, objects are confined by physical barriers. A ball can't pass through a wall without breaking it, but in the quantum realm, particles like electrons behave differently. Unlike classical objects, quantum particles exist as probability waves described by the Schrodinger equation, meaning they don't have definite positions, but rather a range of possible locations. When a quantum particle encounters a barrier, its wave function doesn't abruptly stop, but instead exponentially decays within the barrier region. If the barrier is thin enough, the wave function may still have non-zero amplitude on the other side, meaning there's a mathematical probability that the particle exists beyond the barrier. This remarkable ability for particles to tunnel through barriers isn't magic, but a direct consequence of their wave-like nature in quantum mechanics. Quantum tunneling isn't just a theoretical curiosity. It's essential for nuclear fusion in stars, certain types of radioactive decay, and even the function of electronic devices like tunnel diodes and scanning tunneling microscopes. In semiconductor devices, electrons regularly tunnel through potential barriers that would be insurmountable in classical physics, enabling modern electronics that power our computers and smartphones. Perhaps most mind-bending is that quantum tunneling implies particles have a tiny probability of passing through any barrier, no matter how thick, though this probability becomes vanishingly small for macroscopic objects. The next time you successfully unlock your smartphone with a fingerprint sensor or use flash memory, remember you're witnessing practical applications of quantum tunneling, a phenomenon that defies our classical intuition about how the world works.